do nothing. But this truth, it needs to be told. Because a lot of people perpetrating a fraud. You understand what I'm saying? And I just, it's cool to try to perpetrate something, but tell the truth when the truth is truth. You understand what I'm saying? This, these boys really pioneered some shit that spread it across the world before Instagram. Before YouTube and all, you can film shit on your phone and get everywhere. People know who this is, saw the, the whole lay and everything and copied it before you even had something that promotes you all over the world like this Instagram stuff, bro. That's big in itself. Stem from Kevin Jones, man. When he come do this joint, we all watching him. You know what I mean? So after that, Lip just took it to a whole nother level. And the coup, now you can actually identify who the boys was because of the way we wore the outfits. Most of us didn't even know who you was, but they will see you with a fitted on a certain way, with that dicky on them tails, and they'll know. Now when Lick came, he rocked the dicky too. He just made it a lot more funkier with it. He put on Rolex with it, he, and nobody, nobody wore the dicky. Nobody even know where it came from, really. The LA Bulls, they had them on, but they called them, uh, Khaki we was all over Lick crib. We was hugging his crib. We was like all living there for like week, like like a week or something. So uh, at the time, uh, shit was tight, so everybody was staying close to home. So the young everybody, the young boys, little brothers, they was running and out of there. We was we was, we was, we was like a tight knit like crew. We was all packed in, and uh, what do they call it? we was at it was like we was at the, going to the mattresses. We was like at the mattresses. Yeah, yeah. Took it to the mattresses. Yeah. So we was all at Lick crib up on Fifty First and uh, Kershaw, and um. Somebody decided, let's go up to get something to eat from, um, I think it was Denny's or something up on uh, 69th Street or something like that, bro. Yeah, Denny's up on 69th Street. So we get in there, we like 15 cars deep. <laughs> we like 10 cars deep, but like 15 or 20 of us. So we get this big ass table and the table packed. It's like a big ass table, like 20, about 20 people at the table. So we order all this food, everybody order the food. So I think the bill come back. I can't even remember what the bill was, but, but it was like a nice bill. So, because everybody was just ordering and ordering and ordering. Everybody was picking out. So, all, all I seen out of 20 people, I, I see out of first out of everybody, let's say, hold up, man, I got to make, some, somebody just beat me. And he, uh, and he I got to make a phone call. And he go, and he go walk out the door, and I can get on the phone. And then, and then punk ass, he, uh, next thing you know, he jump up. And he like, uh, yeah, something going on. Somebody calling me too. And he, he, he start walking out the door. And then after that, muscles jump up. And say, hold up. And he start running. Next thing you know, all the motherfuckers jump up and start running out the motherfucking door. And all you hear is the cars spilling out of the car way. All them breaking out the door, jumping over, running out the door. All the white people looking. And everybody stopped and looking. And me and H sitting there looking at these motherfuckers like, damn, these motherfuckers is crazy as shit. And me and H sat there and we, and we broke down the bill. H was mad as shit, snapping. <laughs> you know, man. It's crazy because I believe, remember, vividly, boy, coming through in the cars and all that stuff, right? To my crazy shit, like, especially for that time. I remember we came through with a white convertible, and the car ain't even come convertible. Because, you know, I, I was the type of little kid that I knew I knew my cars. I was just arguing with a boy, Carlock Kev, you know who you is. I said, nigga, this is about a CE Benz. He didn't know what a CE Benz was. There ain't no CE Benz. I said, nigga, it's a CE Benz. You talking about a two seater thing? Cool. I mean, so anyway, I knew my cars. So I seen come through with a, a like a brown, like a Jeep with, or gold hammers on it. Cool hammers if y'all too young to know his rims, you mean, back in the day. Back in the day. Niggas want me wearing gold hammers then on the rims. Lick come through, white joint, burgundy top, burgundy set, five star rims. Then they might go spin them joints off, park them joints up, get to the comeback in the seven or the line, say. Lick might come back in the CE all white. Me, a Porsche. So I, I see the car, but I never really seen boy. And so one day he pulled over into a uh, Jamaica store on the corner of my mom block. And you know, he pulled over, he got the thick phone, gray drawn. Going to, going to, this guy was car he was driving that day. He's going to the store, I just went to the store, just looking at him, you know what I'm saying? You know, as a young boy, you look like, I mean, could you keep hearing his name? Me coming up, observing and seeing a little man, he was a big ball of inspiration. I was inspired by, you know. You know, the way he carried himself, his integrity, you know, how he played amongst his peers, you know, everything represented respect. You know what I'm saying? You know, I admired that as a young guy. You know, I seen a lot do it, and he was one of the main ones that I seen do it well. We have Lick Crib one time and shit. 
We was like, damn, man, come on, let's go play some ball, man. I like play some ball. I'm play ball at, man. I'm gonna go on top of the roof. I got the, I got the basketball court up there. Like, get the fuck out of here, man. We ain't upstairs in the motherfucking rooftop on top of the uh, car garage. Yeah, then they got the basketball court up there, motherfucker. One bullshit, man. We ain't running one on one playing ball. <laughs> the basketball court. That thing was, that thing was crazy, man. He was just doing crazy shit. He was, you can, nigga couldn't see us neither because he had everything blocked off. So that was crazy, like.